I told you I'd win. Maybe I'll let you win. You never let anybody win anything in your whole life. Why would you start now? Now I get to demand a rematch. And I get to leave the deposition. Parkville, Missouri? Of all the places to run into you, Harvey. Glad you can make it. I almost didn't. I was on my way to Bakersfield. After all, Harvey Specter had a flight booked there. When suddenly I had a thought, what would Harvey do? So I checked, and Dana Scott's flight plan was here. Can't get around those pesky FAA regulations, can you? I hope you've got all the cities covered, because we've got people everywhere. Deep pockets. Dana Scott, it's a pleasure. Can't say the same. You do like strong women, Harvey. And you don't like women at all. Oh, she's cute. This should be fun. Oh, I'm just getting a call from my niece who needs help with her homework. What do you got? I know why they promoted Kathleen Mitchell. What is your title, Ms. Mitchell? Vice President, Regional Services. And how many management positions are there in your region? 612. And how many of those are women? 41. 41 of 612, that's 6.6%. 6.7 if you round up. That's not. And who sets the hiring policy? The hiring policy is that we hire the best applicant for each job. I'm confused. Are women inherently inferior then? No. Well, then why is it that your company doesn't want to promote women into positions of power? I am in a position of power. Yes, but you're not exactly like other women, are you? Harvey? You applied four times for management, and you've been rejected every time due to reviews containing the terms aggressive, hostile, and overly ambitious. Then suddenly, you were dedicated, hardworking, and a team player. People change, Harvey. The last I checked, you have to ask a question. I will, and it's about that change. Were you diagnosed with uterine cancer in 2009? That is not relevant. Are you married? What does that have Do you do? have any children? No. Can you have any children? This is beyond the pale, Harvey, even for you. Should I read your deposition of Jessica Pearson from two weeks ago? That's a different case and inadmissible here. Did you or did you not? have a hysterectomy that rendered you unable to have children nine months before you were promoted. She's not going to answer. Maybe not today, but it will become part of the record. Hanley Folsom only promotes women whose attention to home and family isn't in question. Except for one thing, Mr. Folsom didn't know. So you say. He didn't know because I didn't tell anybody, because it's my business. Still, he found out, and that's why you were promoted. Harvey, that's enough. Will you look at that, Harvey? Even Miss Scott understands that being childless and unmarried doesn't make you damaged goods. But if that's how you're framing your argument, good luck. We'll see you in Bakersfield and everywhere else. How could you not tell me that you'd had a hysterectomy? Because I just got the information on my way into the room. Have you been Five seconds to fill me in. I didn't fill you in because I wasn't sure you could play good cop. Because you weren't sure that I could play it or because even when we're on the same side, you still want to win. If I told you, you wouldn't be pissed off. Now you can go to her and call me an asshole with conviction. You're an asshole. Wait a second. You're accusing me of still trying to win? You're the one who's still trying to win something. You know, I should have known. It's never the whole story with you. What the hell's really going on? You beat me last time. And ever since then, Edward Darby hasn't seen me as worthy of being a name partner. Cook would never allow that to happen anyway. He can't stand Americans. Cook retired, and he decided there's more to life than work. So if you deliver a huge win? I get my name on the door. Why don't you just tell me that? You always respond to strength, not weakness. Look at that, you really did fool me. If I'd known that you were that good a performer, I would let you be a good cop. <laughs> <laughs> cook really decided there's more to life than work? Yep. I'll see. see.